I'm Paul Helgerson. I'm an associate professor of medicine and specialize in hospital medicine. I'm also the section head of hospital medicine, so I help run a practice of about 35 doctors that specialize in the same. If you're a resident or a student coming onto a general medicine service, what you learn is both about the treatment of patients typically that have multiple disease processes or complications of severe illness, but you also learn about those care transitions. You learn about quality, you learn about safety, you learn about means of optimally communicating with a patient, with their family, with a care team that needs to be drawn together, often in an individualized way, to a given patient's needs. And those are critical things to be teaching this generation of learners. Inpatient care, for that matter, outpatient care is ever more complex, ever more interdisciplinary, ever more team-based. And there's no environment you know, quite as rich for those sorts of competencies than what we do in general medicine. UVA is actually the head of the curve on a lot of the more innovative educational initiatives that hospitalists can help with. For decades, medical education has tended to center on the, the, the physiologic and scientific treatment of disease, right? And I think what we've discovered is that that's critically important, but there's a lot of other critical competencies for a 21st century physician. Communication, an understanding in, in systematic terms of quality and safety an understanding of uh, you know, how to work within an interdisciplinary team and how to lead an interdisciplinary team. Those are things that hospitals do on a daily basis. And so those are the things that we can help develop curricula. Those are the things that we can provide exposure to residents and students uh, in, in those sorts of uh, disciplines. And that's something that we're really enthusiastic in doing. And medical school here at UVA has recognized that need and has begun to build curricula that really expose learners earlier in their uh, their, their, their education to those other competencies and to do a better job in evaluating them and understanding that folks have hit those milestones before they graduate onto the next step. I'm really enthusiastic for hospitals to be involved in that every step of the way.